hi everyone welcome to my channel today I am going to share my farmhouse and its progress so when I was finished with the floor I decided to look through these walls these walls and the ceiling was a little bit off and it looks like a popcorn ceiling but actually it was not because I tried to scrape it off but it didn't work so I decided to break through it and see what it has actually so I made a little hole on the corner and when I look at it it was all rot so I decided to take off all the interior walls and the ceiling room by room started from the master bedroom and in a start I was thinking I'm gonna break a little bit and take all the trash outside and then break a little bit and take the trash outside but I end up breaking all everything and just leave the trash right there when I get to the ceiling I see that there was a drywall behind it actually and they installed this stucco net and then use this really solid interior stucco material but the thing is the stud behind these really solid walls were all rot so there was no use of having all this good material on the top and heavy material on the top when the studs are not and the frame is not in a good condition so I have to like take off everything everything and uh, on some places I find like three layers of it first layer of stucco second layer of drywall and the wood underneath so it was like two three things after uh, breaking all these walls I feel like I kind of demolate three of the houses that much work it was in it so I end up doing all the breaking work So I remove all the stucco from everywhere and it was so much mess. So we took all the mess out and you see all this green area. This is not um, drywall, it's um, wood veneer and I think it's a quarter inch wood sheets all over in this room. This is another bedroom. This house has only three bedrooms so one on the back and one on the side and one on the other side. After removing all the trash, next stage was to remove the insulation and this was a drywall on the ceiling. So I start breaking this. My husband came to help me in this. He is actually doing his own work so whenever he gets time he came to help. Uh, this was such a big mess. I was thinking that was a mess before but this was the hella mess because every time I am uh, breaking a little bit of the ceiling the dust dust was like crazy everywhere it was so dusty the cotton was so dusty So I and my husband we just cleaned that and now next thing is gonna be that green wall. This all is wood. It was not a drywall so it was so hard. This that's that was another challenge for me. I removed um, stucco from here and now uh, another thing it's a wood. So um, I try to cut through it, I try to break it no matter what, whatever, whatever way it works, I was trying to just take this thing off somehow. For the ceiling, I end up going into the attic and start pushing it downward because it was more easier for me than standing on the floor and then try to pull it downward and the all dust and everything come on me so it was more easier if I go up on the attic and then break it down from there then I came out to do the living room 
and again when I removed the interior stucco there was a uh, wood underneath and this time it was a pretty heavy duty wood underneath and uh, which I have decided to take it out because on some places it was already cracked and broken um, so I removed all this wood I kind of empty the whole house the whole house is just a frame I want it I got it I want it I got it I want it I got it it was this much mess outside in the backyard that we have to rent five or six of these dump containers and they fill so quick I can't even believe I get this much material out from this one tiny little house that five or six of these big big containers we have to fill them so this was it till now the whole house is empty from inside that need all the frame wherever it's it is rot i can replace it now and uh, i can fix it and reinstall everything from the beginning Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel. Until next time, bye bye.